there. I was just reading the Odyssey, um, you know, just being a scholar, learning and things like that. Um, welcome to Tiny Tales of Trisha. This is a series where I, Trisha, will be reading tiny tales. We will be doing 10 minute chunks of storytelling. Um, you know, I know that some of you guys, you're probably in virtual school and you get really sick of just hearing your teacher talk all the time, especially if you have Miss Klein, like she never shuts up. But I'm Trisha. I'm trendy. I'm terrific. And I'm going to teach you about the Odyssey. Let's begin. Okay, so this is an overview of the virtual textbook. Um, your English teacher, Ms. Klein, worked really hard making this for you, but I'm going to break it down in a cool way because I'm terrific, Trisha. All right, so this has this table of contents. And the table of contents, there's a lot. Oh, my gosh, look at all of this. Does your teacher really think you're going to read all of that? Well, maybe she just put more in there for those of you who wanted to learn more. Now, where do you find this virtual text? virtual text. It is on Google Classroom under materials and links. And what you'll be reading in class is in here. And there's also more. Like, for example, I know your teacher probably like told you all about the definition of epic and epic hero. But, you know, maybe she didn't have time to really tell you that much about Homer. So there is some background information about Homer. There are some maps and things that are really interesting. There's some stuff about the real Troy, about Odysseus's island. There's a bunch of stuff in here that maybe your teacher didn't have time to cover in class. So it's here in this virtual text if you would like it. Other cool things to note as you flip through the virtual text. Once you get into the actual reading parts, there's a bunch of art interspersed. So there's pictures from graphic novels. There's background information, there's definitions, there's the text, there's more graphic novels, there's some information like art, okay? Um, your teacher said that as you study the Odyssey, you're going to be learning about art too. So just some elements of art that are helpful to know. Different pictures of the Odyssey in art, artwork inspired by the Odyssey. And then there's a little introduction to each section. Once again, more text. And then there's going to be a lot of information about this great artist from Mark Bearden that I know you're going to look at. And there's also collages. So this is from Mark Bearden's work. And then there's poetry in here too. So there's just a lot in this virtual text. And I'm sure your teacher can't get to all of this in class, but it's there for you um, if you want more. So this is the overview of your virtual text. And please um, like and subscribe to my channel um, and catch the next video, book one of the Odyssey, Tales with Trisha, Tiny Tales with Trisha. I'd like to stop. <laughs>